Hey guys, welcome back to another video episode of Coin Sutra. And in the last video, I've showed you the unboxing of Ledger Nano X, which is the latest hardware wallet from the popular Ledger team. And in the unboxing, I've showed you what all is inside the box. I've also given you a brief of like how is it different than the older version of Ledger wallet. And in this video, I'm very excited to present you how to configure Ledger Nano X. And this is for the first time user. So without further delay, let's go ahead and let's configure this. So to do this, you need few things. One of them is your Ledger wallet. You can use your uh, mobile phone or you can use your laptop either way. You, uh, you'll also be needing recovery sheet to note down the password. And in one of my in, uh, upcoming videos I'll also show you how to use crypto steel to store the password the crypto steel is basically a stainless steel device let me show you quickly that's how crypto steel is and basically instead of using a paper recovery sheet you will be using this to store your mnemonic phrase which actually makes it indestructible physical backup of your of your cryptocurrency but anyways for this video let's keep it simple we'll be using the recovery sheet provided by Ledger team. So here is, here is what we have all we need. We have a mobile phone, we have a recovery phrase where we'll be writing on the recovery phrase, a pen, of course, and our Ledger device. So let's go ahead and let's do this. All right, so the very first thing we need to do is open Google Play Store and search for Ledger Live. It's a Ledger Live app. It's the mobile version of Ledger Live app. Just so click on install, make sure it's the original one with like, you know, it, it got like really good number of downloads, like 10K plus downloads. And yeah, the, I'm not sure why rating is less uh, because of probably the previous version, the demo version was not as opt as how this one is. So anyways, um, so this will take its own time to download, let it, let it happen in between. <laughs> Uh, let's just get accustomed with our Ledger Nano X wallet. Let me remove film over here. So as you can see, there are two buttons. One is here, one is this, which is next to the USB C type. And another one is here on the left side. Now uh, to power on your device, you simply press the right one and your device starts. And it so shows, welcome to Ledger Nano X, press right button to continue. Now, uh, to start, you need to download the Ledger Live app on your mobile or on your computer, so which we are already downloading. All right, so press, you can press the right button or left button to move through the screen. So press both button to validate a selection. Let's do that. And you can anytime you press the both buttons to go to the dashboard. So it shows you the battery. You can power off, you can exit the control center. So this is interesting, like you need, you sometimes if you're moving out, uh, you want to use the mobility feature of Ledger Nano X, you know, you might want to check how much is the battery percentage. Or you can always also use, you know, a connector like this or any simple portable connector to connect mm -hmm. your Ledger Nano X with your mobile phone or with your laptop using the cable itself. But anyways, in this case, let's power, power it off. And once the app get downloaded, which will take some time and then we will I'll show you how to get started with this. So meanwhile you can prepare your yourself by downloading Ledger Live and charging your Ledger Nano X. All right guys, so we are ready. Ledger Live is installed. Now the first thing we need to do is open the Ledger Live app and then click on get started. Now in this case we are using Ledger Nano X. If you're using Ledger Nano X old version you can actually connect that with via wire, but in this case we are connecting with Bluetooth. So let's click on Legend Nano X. Now here are a few options. Uh, we can import a device. We can initialize as a new device. We can re restore from recovery phrase, especially if you're using, you know, moving from old wallet to new one. So in this case, we'll be using as initialize as new device. So it gives me the instruction. All right, turn on your Legend for principle to set up as new device, All right? All right, so now after moving this, you can, you see this option set up as new device. Let's select that. Now select the pin code. Now in this case, I'm just, let's select a basic pin code. And now the most important part start is writing down the recovery phrase. 
so let's let's get into this all right so th this this warning this 24 words are your only backup secure them carefully and as i say like this 24 words are your password if tomorrow you lose your ledger wallet or even your mobile wallet or anything this 24 words are the one which will help you to recover your cryptocurrency wallet you can use it to restore it on any wallet or you can order a new ledger wallet or a backup device to restore it either way but these 24 words are the most important thing that you should be storing carefully now do not store it on a computer or on your mobile use a paper wallet or a crypto still to store it the idea is that it should never touch the cloud so once you're ready just click on click the right button and you can start writing the words so let me do that all right so all the 24 words are here on the recovery sheet now the next thing you're gonna do is press both the buttons press both the button to continue and now you have to confirm the recovery phrase this is just one time thing so that it ensures that the recovery phrase that you have written is accurate otherwise sometimes you know we kind of make a simple mistake and we end up losing our coin all right so the confirm the first word so just all right so press both the button to confirm now confirm the word number two all right so that's the last word let's just confirm this and that's it it's processing and within second the device will be ready but there is a little more that we need to do so that i would show you in a moment and now your device is ready click on access dashboard and now this is where you would be needing laser live app you can either again use your mobile phone or you can use your laptop all right so now let's use both both of them one by one and i'm moving the recovery sheet as we don't need it all right so the very first thing is click on click on continue and yes click on continue got it did you choose your pin code by yourself yes oh okay so yes did you save your recovery phrase by yourself yes so actually what happened like there was time you know and there are it's still happening like some people ordered legend nox from a website like amazon or ebay or some third party website and device come with the recovery sheet with the word added and also the pin code and people think it's that's the device is activated so it's highly recommended that you always buy the device from the official website i'll put the link in the description always buy from ledger official website do tell your friends who is actually planning to buy leisure wallet that it's not advisable to buy it from anywhere else but from the official website all right so click on continue now the next one is click on add new leisure nano x click on that okay i don't know why it's need location settings but let's allow it okay add new. so now it found one device and let's click on it click on pair and connect on this so the code is now the code is matching so click on pair and we just confirm on both the devices to pair hopefully it works all right now it's checking for the genuinity check and allow so you need to press both the button to allow nano ledger manager all right let's click on continue so you can set the password log now this password log is for this laser live app so i'll just skip this for now i'll disable the analytics and bug reports i don't want anything to go to anywhere be it laser now the device is ready so now the, this device is paired with my laser nano x but the thing is i don't have any app installed so i click on what you need to do is open the laser nano app then click on open manager And then it will open the app catalog okay now this is where you'll be installing all the apps on your laser nano x so let, let it open it might take few seconds all right so i want bitcoin app to be installed and i click on download button here 
what's happening here at the back end is by uh, using Bluetooth, this Leisure Live app is installing Bitcoin app on my Leisure Nano X device. And that's so sleek, like that's so fast, almost. And I don't have to connect with the wire. Now, this is something which I've missed in the earlier version of Leisure Leisure devices or the hardware devices. And if you have been an old timer, you would know the pain. So this Legend NOX actually make things way easier and while maintaining the same or better security. All right, let's close this. So similarly, you can install any app that you want. Uh, you can install Ethereum, XRP. There's bunch of coins that you can use. They also integrated with the BNB chain. So you can actually use the BNB chain to log into to store your Binance coin or log into your Binance DEX, which is pretty remarkable. So after this Ethereum, we'll just move to the account part so that you get in the hang of how to use that. All right, as you can see here, we have Bitcoin and Ethereum app both installed. So what we'll do, we'll be opening the, to use a Bitcoin wallet. You actually need to open the Bitcoin app on this device. So let's press this. Now the application is ready. On the device, we click on go to accounts and then we will add an account. So in this case, we add an account. We already have the Bitcoin app open. So we will click on Bitcoin, select the device. And since we don't have anything, it will just open the fur. It will add one Bitcoin wallet to our Leisure wallet. Now you can add unlimited Bitcoin wallet, everything using this accounts feature. And you can rename every wallet as you know, maybe if you're storing, investing for your car or for your house or for any other purpose, you can actually rename it accordingly, which is pretty sleek. Now, another cool thing is like if you ever want to receive Bitcoin, you so now here is the this is Bitcoin once you can edit the name if you like by clicking on edit the name, then you can select it and click on continue. Now this one is added already. Okay. So now right now we don't have anything. Otherwise you would see uh, the total portfolio over here. Now what interesting here is now let's say let's turn this device off by pressing both the buttons. Okay. And then all right, let's power it off. So now the device is off. Now this is where it gets very interesting. You can click on receive, select the wallet. And then in this case, now we don't have the device handy, but we can click on this and we'll still show you the Bitcoin wallet address. You can actually use it to receive your receive coin. Now this is something very handy. So now the only time when you need this device is when you're sending a transaction to sign a transaction, you need to switch it on and, and then you would need this device. Otherwise, anytime for the not checking your portfolio for receiving Bitcoin, you can actually use just your mobile phone as it is. And this actually makes this, uh, the whole operation so handy and so easy to use that you're gonna love it. Now, similarly, you can actually do a few things. You can go to settings, you can go to general, you can change the exchange from which you want to drive the value of the cryptocurrency. Now let's select Bitfinex. You can select the counter value to Bitcoin as well, which is actually the newer version, which is coming out anytime soon. So by the time you're watching this video, you might have it handy. You can also set a few other things like you can set password lock. And similarly, you can always go to manager to install new app. And you can see it has all the wallet that you, all the wallet from all the popular cryptocurrency that you need. It also, you can use Ledger Wallet to connect with other cryptocurrency exchange, which allow you to connect via hardware wallet. So that actually makes your assets very secure. And yeah, you can always click on, you know, send and receive to send the cryptocurrency from your wallet. Well, there you go, buddy. Uh, this, that's how you actually use Ledger Nano X. I know it's a, it's a long video, but I hope this video has given you all the idea that how to start using Ledger Nano X. And pretty much that's it. So guys, this is how you use Ledger Nano X. I know it's, a, it's an amazing device uh, with 100 plus app storage, Bluetooth enabled and mobility, probably the best hardware wallet right now that you can buy. It's actually uh, very affordable. They take care of the shipping. They do deliver worldwide. You can pay using, you know, Visa, credit card, even cryptocurrency, and they take care of the shipping. So 
basically it's an amazing device it's a good idea that you can actually order two devices one legend nano x and one old legend nano s or you can buy two legend nano x either way depending on how much is your budget so this one can work as your regular device this one can work as your backup device let's say if you sometime you end up losing your legend nano x you can restore your wallet in legend nano s or or if you, if you don't mind you can actually buy two legend nano x at the same time I will leave all the link in the description to buy Ledger Nano X, to download Ledger Live, or also the link to my earlier video on Ledger Nano X unboxing. Well, with that, do let me know how you like this video. If you have any question regarding Ledger Nano X, feel free to ask me in the comment section below. Do like and share this video with your other friends who are looking to get into cryptocurrency and still using desktop or mobile wallet for storing a large sum of amount, which is not safe. And do not forget to subscribe to our channel. This is your host, Harsh Agrawal. I will see you later. Bye-bye.